today, it is almost expected that the bride will cry and shed tears. Um, I'm challenged right now not to cry. Uh, you see, I also am in love with this young lady, and we have a long journey together. A journey that's been fraught with some ups and some downs, and, and yet we are gathered here today to celebrate her union with Mark, and uh, I am deliriously happy. So, Tony, thanks for allowing me to be here with you. I stand here ready to become your husband, your friend, someone I can trust and confide in. You are the woman I have searched for all my life. You give me hope, better things. You pick me up when all crashed down. You gave me back the fight to live once again. You showed me the way to take. You showed me the way when I was lost. I know your past has been one of broken dreams and torment. But today, I ask you to take my hand and walk with me into the future to build new dreams. Side by side, hand in hand, as my wife and my best friend. When I look into your eyes, I see my soulmate, my family, and my future. I wear this ring as a reminder of this day when I commit myself to you and our family be a strong partner to you and the children, regardless of what life has in store for us. I stand here ready to take the challenges of marriage and be the best husband, father, and worker I can possibly be. Today, my wife is waiting to go. A love that has healed me, my children, and filled a huge void. My life has been difficult for many reasons that most will never understand. The tragedies that I have endured alone have taken their toll on me, and I have not been given many worldly gifts. But I have learned how strong I am in the face of the unknown. Though all my hard days, I would pray for someone to understand, someone to care, and someone to stand beside me and fight with me through these times. Mark, you are my perfect match, my warrior and my savior. You are not afraid of life, for you know what it is like to suffer, to have dreams crushed and your heart broken. From the day we first met, it was hard to deny the connection. The way you remembered me from the past inspired me to try. Your innate understanding of struggle bonded us in such a way. Most people talk about love and what love is, and how they will weather storms in sickness and in health. Well, I can honestly say that you have proven that, that you are strong enough to be my man. You understand real life and have built an homage to me for promise, care, and understanding. You don't promise what you can't deliver, and you work hard at being a great man. Saying I love you is not a strong enough word to express my feelings for you. It is a feeling I feel when I see you talk with Melissa, walk with Jenna, give advice to Jesse, and nurture Joshua. It's a feeling I feel at night when my tea is sitting by my bedside and I'm held when I'm sad and I'm sick. When you are gentle and kind and loving when I'm feeling frustrated and defeated. Love for you is not a word, not a gift on a holiday. It is an everyday expression from you to me. This day connects two lost souls and creates a powerful formal bond that cannot be broken. I wear my ring with pride, knowing that my heart belongs only to you. I am proud to be your wife, and with this ring, I stand with you for the rest of mine. And she placed that ring on her, on Antoinette's finger. Simply say, with this ring, I be well. Mark's finger. With this ring, With this ring I do wed. By the authority invested in me as a preacher of the gospel of Jesus Christ, and by the commonwealth 
of the state of Pennsylvania. It is with great joy I get to pronounce you husband and wife. When God has joined together, let no man put us up. You may kiss your brother. Ladies and gentlemen, I do present to you Mr. and Mrs. Mark DeLorenz. My house in Budapest, my, my hidden treasure chest, golden ground piano, my beautiful Castillo. Ooh, yeah. Ooh, I give it all. of the land I have achieved. It may be hard for you to stop and believe, but for you, ooh, ooh, I give it all. Give me one good reason why I should never make a change. And then he said, no, I really do know you. He said, can I ask you a question? And I was like, yeah. He said, do you know this person? And I was like, why? And he goes, because I know you. I remember you from 1984. You had this on and you were doing this. And I was so taken aback by that. So we have kind of a history here now. We got a gas station, right? Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. So how did you recognize somebody from it so many the, years it, ago? It was her eyes. I was sitting at the bar and I just looked over and I, she just looked up. I could see her eyes over the top of the computer screen. And I was like, I know her. And I just said, I'm going to talk to her. How many years passed between the actual engagement, or I mean, not the engagement, but that moment where you met at Applebee's in 1984? I think it was uh, like 20 years. Yeah, or 20, 25 or years. Maybe 25 years. 25 years. It might have been even longer. And you she was 14, so I was. Long time. <laughs> how, old are, how old are you two now? I'm 51. Sorry. I'm 44. Okay. And uh, yeah, so you guys have known each other since you were teens. Right, but I, I have remembered the incident, but not as vividly as he did. Uh, from all of his friends that I had talked to afterwards, they had said, no, he brought up this little Italian girl every time I talked to him. At your time, he was like at Christmas time or drinking or whatever. He said, I wish I could find this little Italian girl. And he found his little Italian girl. Yeah. And now, you know, you, um, let's let's talk about uh, your daughter. And she, she's the reason why a, a, a lot of this is possible today. Right? That's correct. Genevieve um, is a very, very special child. She has a lot of challenges. She has metachondrial neuropathy. And 
a lot of my life go, has gone to her and her brothers. And I think she's felt over the years a need to give back. So initially she contacted Jamie to, to really volunteer for her. Because Genevieve has got that kind of soul where she wants to give back. And then when it came to be that I was giving up more of myself, my wedding money actually, to give her more things, she decided to contact Jamie and said, look, I have a dream now. Can you please help me get my mother married? I really want to get back to her. So my Genevieve's very special.